Hi everybody, uh, welcome back to my channel. This is Icebit149. Uh, as you may know, I've uh, beaten the record of the most barrel runs, which uh, was 420, uh, set by Hellzomen 2. Uh, I have uh, made it 444. Uh, in this uh, clip, I will show you uh, all the items I got and uh, yeah, how I did this. That is uh, this basically. You could also see that in the first vid. Um, the original idea of this was uh, made by Wild Daniel. He uh, did 400 runs without banking. Then about one year ago, Hellzoman did uh, 420, and I thought, from hey, what the hell? Let's try this, and I made it 444. Uh, wasn't really good profit, uh, as you may know. Barrows is worth shit at the moment, and yeah, it was. <laughs> Uh, let me think it was 10 mil profit so yeah I was doing this for two maybe three weeks don't do this this way it is that I only did this for the record otherwise I could just as well not have done this uh, but yeah I don't care about money anymore so yeah uh, well okay how how did you actually do this and why did you just take shitty items? Why not full Garnadermic and uh, full Bandos? Well, I did take full Armadil though. Uh, well, I thought, yeah, I can like take full Garnadermic with Garnadermic Flakes, and then if they're almost done, I can ask someone to repair it for me. But uh, that's not as fun as doing this. After a while, well, you probably will have already seen it, that my Arims was degraded after a while, so yeah, wasn't really, uh, wasn't really handy. But that's part of the game, you know. If you don't want that, then uh, yeah, well, oh, fuck you. Uh, well, it's just basically just because well, why Daniel and Hellzoman didn't do that either. So yeah, I just took barrows in my armor deal because well, yeah, I didn't really have Kareels or money for Kareels and I only had like armor that I could lend so that's why. Uh, anyway well as you can see I'm using uh, Barrage uh, or Barrage or what you will call it and well that is a way to not make them like hit you that's why, uh, why I use that it's it really is good and handy, but because it's really expensive, you won't really make profit. Uh, well, 444 chests, 10 mil profit. That's not not a lot. Uh, so yeah, that's why. Um, yeah, that's why you should actually go just with uh, a lot of prayer. And yeah, if you do that, then you will use a lot of prayer, but you will not uh, like lose. 100k a trip around because that's pretty sick. Um, well, a uh, few things a couple of friends of mine asked were uh, why didn't you do the Mor Mortiana Elite tasks? Um, well, yeah, it, they just came out when I was planning to do this, so that's why I didn't. If you do, then the prayer drain that will come from if you see like the head thing, uh, it will be halved and the runes you get will be doubled so yeah that is nice then maybe you should have like I would have gotten a lot more profit and that would be nice but yeah if you did not do those then really Barrows isn't a way to make money anymore and what the hell my complete computer is freaking out uh, okay well that doesn't really matter anyway um so if you did those then that's nice and well it barrels will still be a good way to make money but if not then I yeah I'd say don't go there unless you're low level for low levels it's great I have to admit that I did a lot of barrels when I was low uh, however then good on spear was still 10 mil or something so yeah Anyway, uh, another thing that you can have done is, uh, what's it called, Ritual of the Majorat. Uh If you have done that, you will have unlocked Akrisas the Doomed, and, well, let me just check. 
Uh, Acrisaz at the moment, uh, the most expensive part is the Acrisaz rope top. Uh, well, the degraded Acrisaz rope top, which is actually 500k more than the normal one. I don't think that's right, but okay. Uh, so yeah, then you can also have that as a reward, and well, the other parts of Acrisaz are also pretty much expensive, so yeah. Um, and if you have done that, then if you find a chest, you can just teleport out of the barrows and teleport back to the main ground of the barrows, which is nice because you do not have to walk the whole fucking maze again. That was like really the most frustrating thing in everything I've done because it's like, oh yeah, I got the chest and now you have to run all the way back and you get hit and bleh, it's just, just sucks. Okay, uh, anyway. As you may have seen, I had some pack checks with me. Uh, yeah, well, uh, Wyo Daniel and Hells Omen had uh, imp boxes, but since you can bank more with a pack check, I thought, hey, I have 96 summoning, well, 99 at the moment, but back then I had only 96, so I will take some pack checks in so that I can bank a lot more. Uh, they did come in handy, however, I did not pick up the tooths and loops because I thought I did not have enough space for that. Uh, later it turned out I had easily enough space for that, but okay. Uh, well, also, uh, didn't your armor degrade over time? Well, I found like 3, 4 good on chest plates and good on chain skirts, uh, one good on helm, two good on spear, and an uh, iron rope top. But indeed, my iron rope bottom did degrade. I did not find a single iron rope bottom, which is pretty sad since that's the, like the most expensive part. If I had instead of four iron hoods, four iron rope bottoms, I would have had like 20 mil profit. Okay, but yeah, that is like just bad luck. And yeah, anyways, uh, well. Do you f would you do this again? Well, seriously, no. This was probably the most boring thing I've done in months. Uh, the only reason why I went going is that I already put up on Hell's Omen's channel that I would beat his record. I mean, the fuck, I still don't know how I did this. I do know that I have done like a hundred runs in a day over time. So, yeah. Well, that was actually like second to last day. I did nearly 100 runs. Pretty, well, pretty cool actually. Um, well, thanks uh, for listening to me whine about how I did this, uh, you know. And I hope you guys enjoyed. If you want to do this and beat my record, I say go ahead. Good luck with it. Uh, yeah, well, I seriously mean that because I think you will fall asleep before you actually have done this. But if you have done it, please put a, what do you call it, reaction on my channel. Uh, and the hope that I will read this. And, well, I will uh, congratulate you and put a link of my video, of your video, in my video. If you know what I mean. So, well, uh, anyway, uh, good luck, guys. Keep it cool. Please subscribe, rate, comment, uh, the basic shizzle. And, well, see you guys next time. I think I will do some God Wars or anything like that. Maybe another staking vid. I have recently began staking again with a nice profit. But I did not fit it. So, yeah. I will... Well, we will see. Anyway, uh... See you guys, and uh, good luck with everything.